Hello, good afternoon. Another purchase has just arrived from Banggood. It's an oximeter. Uh, this little device is able to tell me my pulse rate and oxygen saturation of my blood. Uh, takes two AAA batteries. Um, not that big a device. The idea is you pop it on your finger and it'll tell you your heart rate and oxygen saturation. So let's turn it on, hold the button there, fires up, it's looking for a finger now. If I don't put a finger in there, eight seconds and it powers down again. So there you go, let's put it on again. In we go with the finger. Little yellow lights flash in there, showing it can detect a finger and it's just taking a measurement. And we'll see in a few seconds, oxygen saturation is 99%. Uh, pulse rate is 6970. Uh, if I confirm or check that on my Apple Watch and the uh, heart rate is bang on, that is accurate. I can't confirm the the oxygen saturate, saturation in the blood. Um, I'm told 95 to 100 is normal. It's on 99, so if that makes me normal, then that's great. Uh, you can alter the display depend on the orientation if you read in this from somebody else's finger that would be more appropriate that way round uh, you get the idea just press and press and that'll keep going I believe until you take your finger out there is a menu with it um, just take that off give it a few seconds to power down And we'll go into the menus. I don't know if you can read that. It's uh, there's basically you can turn various sounds on and off. Uh, you can alter the brightness settings here also. It's on maximum brightness, uh, which is okay in a dimish room. Bright sunlight you might have a problem. Press it once more. You go into a second menu. Uh, this is where you can set an alarm for if the heart rate's too fast or the blood saturation, the oxygen saturation, I should say, um, isn't what you'd want it to be. It would alarm. So, um, yeah, there's. Let's press that, that'll exit the menu. And we'll go back to uh, how it functions. Just turn the display around, so there you go. Give it a few seconds just to kick in. 99 oxygen, uh, 68 pulse. You may be able to see two different lights flashing. Um, to my eye, there's only one. That's because one is visible light, the other is infrared. Uh, the idea of that, you got down the on the, this side, let me just down here you've got the transmitters at the top section you've got the receivers uh, and those lights will shine across to one another and the sensor in the top will detect how much light is actually being sent across now you poke your finger in there that's going to affect how much light actually gets sent across to the receivers and based on that absorption of light into your finger um, the sensors will determine what your pulse rate is uh, and also your oxygen saturation levels. Uh, how accurate it actually is, I, you don't want to trust your life on this, but it would be a, a device that will give you a reasonable indication of your oxygen level and your pulse rate, I think. Um, and for 899 it's worth a try. Uh, if, you, if you're one of these um, keep fit people, it may be handy for you. Uh, when you come back for a run, just see how uh, what your pulse rate is, how quick you recover from that. Although you may well have a Fitbit, so this is more keeping the medical cupboard. That's kind of what I'm going to be using it for. Uh, but all in all, eight ninety nine delivered to your house, not too bad. Just pop that open. You can see the battery compartment there. I'm not going to take it all apart. Uh, it's going to be a, a couple of chips on a board going off to a display not a lot more that really we're going to see could even be a, a, a blob on a board but yeah that's the oxygen and pulse rate 
meter, the oxymeter um, from Banggood. You do get a, back, uh, a, a book of words. Um, it gives you an idea of what I was explaining to you. Um, two LEDs, uh, well, two transmitters, uh, two receivers of different uh, styles of light um, shining through your finger. And from there, it'll determine, um, well, if you're alive and uh, what your blood saturation is, or oxygen saturation in your blood. Keep saying your blood saturation. Do get a little la lanyard with it, so you could carry it around with you if you wish. Um, you can detach it there, if need be. But I think that's just uh, so the nylon cord can fit through and be replaced if need be. But yeah, eight ninety nine, not too bad from Banggood. If you want one, get one. If not, you can see what it's like. I just showed you uh, a little bit of plastic film on the top will come off. Might make it slightly brighter. Uh, it's a nice clear display. OLED. Um, I think it says about eight hour battery life. I'm a bit, a bit suspicious about that. But then it's not the sort of thing you leave on your finger for half an hour. So uh, yeah, it's as good as it gets. So yeah, that'll go in the medicine cabinet just as and when I might need it. Um, links are in the description uh, to the item from Banggood should you wish to uh, purchase one. There's lots of different ones on there at the moment. Some may be more accurate than others. Some may be exactly the same as this, but they're going to charge you twice as much. Um, all down to what you want and what you want to pay for. But yeah, uh, the finger oximeter OLED display from Banggood. Get one if you wish.